Hi everyone, this is Julia from The Adventure Geek and if you don't know by now, I'm doing the PCT, which is the Pacific Crest Trail and I fly out in less than 60 days time, so I'm very, very excited. I've been dialing in my gear really for the last 18 months or so. Uh, I've swapped every sort of bits out here, there and everywhere. My final bit of gear that I was waiting for that I hadn't quite sorted out was my mid-layer. Uh, I'm so incredibly happy with this mid-layer that I've got, so I'm going to tell you this week all about the OM, that's the OMM Core Plus hoodie. So stay tuned. So one of the hoodies that everyone seems to be wearing on the PCT, and I've got a little bit of envy there, is the Melanzana or the Melly that people wear. So you'll see it on all the YouTube videos, um, but they don't do anything like that in the UK, or so I thought. So if you're looking for a Melanzana equivalent uh, in the UK, then this one is absolutely the bee's knees. So I'm wearing it now. It is called the Om um, Core Plus Hoodie. And it's like a fleece, but it's literally half the weight. So this weighs 125 grams. Um, it's super, super fluffy. And I must admit, when I got it and held it up to the light, and I'll show you what that means, looks like in a second, you can literally see through it. And I was thinking, there's no way on earth this is going to keep me warm. But we're here in the UK, it's frigging freezing at the moment. And I've been wearing this now every single day for the last two weeks. And I actually slept in it in my tent uh, this weekend just gone as well. And it is the bee's knees. Uh, so let me just go through some of the features. It's made of a, a particular weave, which is called a primer loft. I don't know if you've ever heard of that, um, but I'll put a link down below so you can read up a little bit more about that. Um, it's really, really thin. It wicks really well, so it will dump heat if need be. But it's, I don't know how it works. It's really strange how it works, uh, but it does keep you extremely warm. I haven't had like a shell on top or anything and I've just been walking uh, with my sun hoodie underneath and it's been like minus one degrees out there. So it has kept me really warm. I love the, on the cuffs, you've got like a, a double weave. So it sort of doubles up. So you can put it up over your hands and it will keep your hands nice and warm as well. Um, it doesn't seem to let, cold air in i don't know how it works um, but it will let your warm heat out so i don't know it just works they've done the seams in a particular place so it doesn't rub against your backpack it's got a really long um, base as well so it covers covers your bum and keeps your bum warm which i love uh the hood that's my sun hoodie hood but my the hood comes up and it's really nice and snugly and it's got a uh, net gaiter sort of built into it as well. So it made me think, do I actually need a net gaiter or a buff? I don't know yet. I probably will take one anyway because they're handy for other things. And I've got a buff as a bit of a snot rag on my rucksack as well. Um, but I do love the net gaiter. Um, so yeah, the price is probably the only thing that's a bit naff. Um, they, if you go onto the OM website, they're about a hundred pounds. Um, but I got mine that you can shop around and I got mine, I think from sports pursuit or somewhere like that at around 74 pounds, but considering how much I've worn it, I've just worn it nonstop and it hasn't got smelly or anything within a week of wearing it every single day and also sleeping in it one night. It doesn't feel smelly. Um, so yeah, I just love the material. I've never had anything like this before. Um, I've now noticed as well that they also have the core made of the same material. They do beanies uh, that do the same and they also do tent socks. Um, so I have got some down booties, but I'm also very tempted because it's so fluffy and just really nice to wear. So one of the things that's naff about it, it's got no pockets, but you know, do I need pockets? Probably don't because I'll be having a rucksack over the top of it. And I've got my OM um, smock with a really nice kangaroo pocket that I can fit over if I do get cold. Um, and they also do, not as well just, so they do OM beanies, OM tent socks and OM mittens. I probably won't bother with the mittens because I'm already sorted with those. 
Anyway, I'm waffling, but I just thought I'd show you my new hoodie. I love it and uh, yeah, I've been living in it. So that's me done. I've more or less done my gear, so I will probably put up a, a gear video, a full gear video in the next few weeks. So. so thanks very much for following along. If you wanted to follow the blog, um, I will be blogging. I have been blogging about all the preparation that I'm doing for the PCT. I'm using some software called Find Penguins, uh, and I'll put a link to the blog just down below. Um, and I'm literally doing a bit of a countdown as like a roundup once a week of all my learnings. So things about safety on the trail and you know how to hitchhike safely um, I've been using a new thing called a, a reco reflector I don't know if you've ever heard of that so I've got all sorts of things that I've been blogging about so if that's of interest to you then just click on the link and follow along there um, that's me signing out for another week I shall see you soon don't forget to get outside get inspired go take a hike when you can I'll see you on the next one take care ta-da bye bye